Bonjour, buenos dias, guten morgen, good morning, god morgen, bon dia, dobre jutra, buongiorno, jiao shanghao, ohayo zaimas. Good morning, B-Sides. Thank you all very much for being here today. Uh, thank you all very much for uh, caring enough to mask uh, while you're here. And uh, remember, everybody, it's hot out there. It's dry in here. Drink lots of water, OK? Cool. Why are we all here? I mean, it's been 15 years since the, last, the first time that this thing happened. Um, Mostly that just makes me feel old, but this is a, I mean, truly kind of an amazing longevity. This, this community has grown so much in that time. This is, as of today, the 1,003rd Security B-Sides event that we know of in the world. 1,003. So I'm not just old, I'm actually kind of amazed. Um, and how did this happen? I, you know, mostly, uh, I think it's because of you folks. I've got a few ideas. My grandmother had a saying that there's nothing so bad that it ain't good for something. And this entire conference exists because there were conversations that we couldn't have at Black Hat, at RSA, or any number of other places, right? Rejection, failure, exclusion. These things are terrible in the moment. But this community exists because people look at those, they took those things and they actually built something from them that was not only unique, but truthfully stronger and more flexible in some ways that were desperately needed in the world. There are situations in life and in our industry where you'll only get one shot and you need to cross your T's and dot your I's, where there's no makeup and there's no recovery option and you can't unbreak eggs if you drop them, right? But most beginnings aren't like that. Most beginnings are about learning. And the only way to learn new things, things that actually new things that nobody's learned before, is by doing. The most important part is begun. Even with a tiny group of people in a tiny room, even if you overcrowd your tiny room or the next bunch of tiny rooms so badly that you have to shoehorn a bunch of portable AC to keep from expiring by perspiring, even if you overload that AC so badly that your power cord decides to actually halt and literally catch fire, the important part is still begun. If you begin hard enough and keep at it, you can work well out. And there's a good chance it will work out well, especially with the right help. Best of all, so you know, there's the old saying, to go fast, go alone, to go far, go together. But if you can find a way to go with just enough people to get you where you need to go as fast as you can, that's even better, right? And B-Sides excels at this. Decentralization, duocracy. If every B-Sides had to be set up by Jack and Banshee and Naus and Cinders and all the rest of us, we'd still be at a couple of dozen, not a thousand and three. We wouldn't have the global reach. Because it's decentralized, because we come together wherever we're needed, and by we, I mean you guys, you gals, you everyone out there, and us. We get things done without a whole bunch of state transfer, vertical communication. We're not just a conference because of that. We're a movement. And all you've got to do to be part of it is participate the next time one comes around in your neighborhood. So many wonderful things have started here. B-Sides is a place for beginnings. Wonderful, amazing programs have begun here and grown into movements of their own. Pros versus Joes. I am the cavalry. 
our proving ground mentored track for new speakers that's so effective and impactful that conferences like Black Hat started doing it as well. Public dialogue about mental health in our profession, again, pioneered here. Our ground truth data science track has spawned you know, other organizations that are doing, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, uh, wonderful things that got started at our annual data science meetup here. I can't even begin to cover the impact that you have when you and your fellow participants take the things you start here out into the world. You are part of that. You are here to do that. The co-founder you'll meet, the new employer or future colleague that you'll get to know, the cool skill you'll pick up just because you're here and you can spend 20 minutes or how an hour or even a couple of days with someone who isn't just a world-class expert in something, but is so jazzed and so excited about it that they love to share it with everybody that they can. You are a part of that. But it's not just about starting things. B-Sides is a community to sustain and boost these beginnings. Open, welcoming, built to incorporate the best from any place we can find it and to celebrate and elevate those fantastic fellow travelers. Passwords Con, Sky Talks, Higher Ground, each of them led by people who came to B-Sides with fantastic ideas and track records already and made us and themselves better and more impactful as a result of coming together. I mean, after all, what is B-Sides? A B-Side is a cheap record, right? It's, it's a place to experiment, to learn, to come up with something new and unexpected and wonderful and give it a chance, just a chance, for the world to realize how powerful it is. Whether that's a person, or an idea, or an organization, or a whole movement. But all of that, every bit of that, of what that can be, begins with you. And that brings me to my request, and the reason I'm taking a little longer to get to those talks today. You knew it was too good to be true, right? There's always a catch. We always are going to ask something from you. So when you leave this room today, after the keynote, please, because you don't want to miss that bit about the amazingly accomplished people sharing what they love best and care most about, right? But when you leave this room today, this is my request for your B-sides, and it's only a request, but go begin something new. Talk to someone you haven't before. Learn something you never thought you'd need for your job, like how to pick a lock or how to operate a ham radio or whatever is just interesting. But better yet, help something that's already started to grow. Whether that's you or whoever's sitting next to you right now, but go ahead, take a look right now and make eye contact with the person to your left or your right, or at least make eye contact with their shoes, and their shoes instead of your shoes. Like, I mean, we're all, you know, geeks here, we get it. That's fine too. And no, it doesn't work if you all look left at the same time, and then you all look right at the same time, right? Because this is something, like most things, that works better with each of you figuring that local bit out for yourselves, rather than some central authority trying to coordinate everything. But take that look anyway and make a mental note. And at some point in the next two days, not right now, but sometime after the talk, walk up to those folks, and then if they look confused, that's okay. Remember, a lot of us are a little bit face blind, okay? So that just means you don't have to worry about it. But you walk up and you tell them, Damon Tanner sent you, and you ask that person what they really care about. What's their thing? What's really cool and exciting? And what they're looking forward to while they're here? And okay, I mean, that's a little too long. We can do better. There's a great Irish word for this, a great word for B-sides in general, actually. Just walk right up and say, hey, DT sent me, what's the crack? That's C-R-A-I-C, no K. Very important distinction. A lot of us have you know, security clearances to maintain, that kind of thing. But I promise you that no K crack is 100% compatible with that. 
crack is a good time. It's a fun experience. It's a friendly conversation, right? And it can be the thing that has happened or is going to happen or even something that's happening right now. It's good crack, the word crack. And B-sides is good crack too. So Damon sent me, what's the crack? And see where it takes you, right? See what you can learn and what you can help grow. And I'm, I'm gonna warn you, we'll be checking up on this at the end of the conference. So just remember, when somebody walks up and says, hey, what's the crack? This is as official as B-Sides Business ever gets, and sharing the crack is a moral imperative. It's how all of this got started, and how all of it continues to grow, and how all of us change the world one life at a time. That's enough of that. Put a pin in it. Because uh, in just a few minutes, we're going to have uh, Sven Cattell come here and uh, talk about how ML security can best draw from our accumulated experience in designing and operating secure and safe systems in order to address the actual critical risks that are manifest in AI systems, rather than some of the more shallow threats that get endless chattering attention today. So stay, stay tuned, stay put, and oh, yep, there's our man right here. We're gonna get him set up and uh, you guys will get to hear some very interesting stuff.